Tonight, will we stay dry for the next few days, giving neighbors a chance to clean up after the storms? Our chief meteorologist Chris Holcomb is here with what we need to know. Chris, we are going to see a drier pattern set up, and that will help in that cleanup process here. And you know, earlier we we reported that the, this tornado that was in southern parts of Troop County, moving over into Meriwether County and over toward Pine Mountain, has now been rated as an EF3 tornado. The National Weather Service survey team went in uh, to see how strong those winds were based on the damage that was left behind and they're saying winds were around 150 miles an hour. Now this is the preliminary information. We don't have the track of the storm yet, but this is where it first touched down near West Point, moved across the southern parts of Troop County south of LaGrange and then over toward Pine Mountain. That's where Joe Ripley was reporting uh, just a little while ago, but we are drier now. We had some showers and storms this morning. Those pushed out and went well down to the south. Now that heavier rain and those storms are well down to the south and we will be dry for the rest of the nighttime hours tonight. In fact, take a look at this mainly clear skies. It has been a warm day up to 80 degrees for a high. We'll be in the 70s through about 8, 9 o'clock, then into the 60s and 50s here by tomorrow morning. Stay with us. We'll let you know how long this drier pattern sticks around and when we'll see the next chance for rain in the seven day outlook. All right.